The USHL Fall Classic was also a great showcase for drafted players in the USHL. There are a lot of players that already have NHL draft rights spoken for in the USHL this year, and the highest pick among them is Adam Guy on the goaltender from the, the Green Bay Gamblers. And what a performance he put in. He won both of his starts, had a 929 save percentage over the two games. It's expected that he's going to play an absolute ton for Green Bay this season. And with that, that's where the development is really going to hit its stride because he's a player that just continues to need to play. Last year was his first year in North America. He played for the Chippewa Steel in the NHL. And then he played a few games with the Green Bay Gamblers, ends up staying with that team, and now he's going to be in the USHL. And I talked to Adam after the game, you know, I said, explain, you know, not a lot of draft eligible players go back to the USHL. He said, well, or sorry, drafted players go back to the USHL. They usually move on to college. But he said, very, and he said this last year as well, he needs to play more to develop. And he's going to get more games in the USHL than he would in college. And he's going to get the reins for this roster. As long as he stays healthy, he's going to be a guy that is clearly on the on the path to being the the, the long-term starter for this team and also a guy that could potentially lead them to uh, great success this season. He's also likely headed back to the World Junior Championship this year, which is uh, uh, where he really made his name and, and put himself on the draft radar. Uh, but to see the way that he battles, the way that he competes, and then also the athleticism and quickness that he shows in the net and the decisions that he was making, and I think he even played a little bit more controlled, that's a player that you know we identified going into the tournament or into the showcase as a player to watch. He's one coming out of it where we say, here's a guy that is really, really developing and putting his best foot forward as an as, as a future NHL goaltender, and he will be headed to the University of Minnesota Duluth next year. 